All right. Roll it, Lester. Welcome, listener, to Full Spectrum Cycling. It's a show number 273. Whoa. Mm. Wow. Here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. Seems like it only oh, started. Is there cricket? Years ago. Yeah, <laughs> I think I hit the cricket button, too. Wow. Yep, Let, let's listen to that. Okay, again. I'll, I will respond. I'm sorry. I didn't know it needed to be bang, bang. Damn, dead air. There they are, folks. Crickets. Crickets. Uh, 273, that's the show today. Podcast MKE Studio in Milwaukee. Same place we had Steel is Real last weekend. Yes, indeed. That was a blast. That was a good time. Yeah. How'd that go for you guys? Yeah. Very good. Very good. Yeah. I kind of jumped on the... Uh... I'm going to block traffic. Yeah, that worked out well because yeah, we, yeah, there was I don't know. A few I, times where that was I, needed. I, 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 yeah, yeah, I just I felt like I left unregulated or unmarshaled on that one. Yeah, it would have been kind of a hassle, right? It was just enough people that it could have been problematic. But speaking of that, how many people were there? Did you get a well, count? I didn't I th- get a count. I think you know people came and went a little bit, thirty-five ish on yeah. the oh, long yeah. end, and you know, kind of towards the end, it thinned out some. Yeah, it was fun. When people got a little bit toasty, <laughs> you know, I I that was I toasty. rarely <laughs> eat at what, Skipper Buds. No, what's that called? Yeah, see <laughs> here. Barnacle Buds. Barnacle Buds, but that was a pretty proper burger. I thought it was a pretty better. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Look at losing all that stuff I, going on there. I thought it was a pretty a pretty proper burger for you know. Pretty proper bur- bur- pop pop. Try say that <laughs> ten times fast. Proper burger for Tony Burger. Right. Uh, yeah, different. they did a decent job. Uh, I was happy with that, being that it was the only real food stuff. I also, for the record, threw one ball at Kaz's mini bowl, striked it. Yep. Call myself, you too? Same here. Call myself. Struck it in I, one and you're out? Yep, yep. I'm it, man. I'm <laughs> like, that was it. it I'm like, I'm done. I, George Costanza. Right? right? I'm like, sorry, Lons, but yeah. I'm, I don't I'm going to make the Seinfeld reference for that one. <laughs> I'm going out on top, baby. I don't know that that those lanes were much longer than this room. Those lanes were not longer than this room. They're, no. they're There's very no short. way. They yeah, were it was tiny. Like, it was like flat track ski ball. Yeah, that's kind of how yeah, I felt. Yeah, it's like duck pin sized balls and and pins, but a really short lane. Yeah, with uh, human pin setters. Right, that was. Clear. I was surprised that they had they had two of them there because it was uh, that busy. Actually, had three four. of them. Three. Was it three? Well, one guy was doing two lanes, and yeah. okay, wow. Yeah, he was the one doing the spin yep. and whatever. Uh, He's doing like the cocktail. So apparently, <laughs> bottle spinning. Who was telling pin? me this? That if they roll the, um, if they roll a tennis ball with the um, rubber bands on it, that's kind of like the the hint to roll them a tip. Like oh, throw really? some money in it and then whip it down. Oh, funny. Were I don't there know tennis balls about, there. Yeah, I didn't yeah. know that. Well, no. I don't know if it was there, but it had like a different. Interesting. I didn't see any there, but I, I greased those guys pretty good. So. It was a fun stop. Yeah, there was I'm a sure. fat I, stack on I, that I, table. I was like, what the I, hell is I also going on tipped here? the bartender a lot, a lot of money for yeah. three PBRs. Yeah. And then the bar wanted money for kind of rental of the lanes, too. And I'm like, mm-hmm. everybody's getting money here. Yeah. But we did have but fun. But we had fun. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah and a, definitely that was a big crowd for that place, for sure. So, you know, normally yeah. it's $5 a game per person if uh, you're going to roll a whole game. Uh, yeah. So, you know, it's pretty affordable. Yeah, right. And the El oh. Tapatio truck is right outside. And they do that. they split that money with the pin setters, setters supposedly. Right. So I think they did okay. They, yeah, I think they did. I think every place well, they we did stopped be- at did fine. They did better than if we would have done the fifty fifty thing. So yeah, there you go. And they had to go around and suck more money out of people's pockets. I had none. I had not until I still have a whole bunch of cash in my pocket now because I cash accumulated at the uh Barnacle Buds place. Oh, right on. <laughs> Yeah, so it was, uh, yeah, Hollander, Nomad, Causes, the, the Kashubi. With, with, with a slight surprise at the first half. What was that? Well, walking inside, going like, well, the front is, the inside isn't really open. And I was like, what? Oh, at Nomad? Oh, yeah. I was like, well, they opened at 11, which is right when oh, we got there. Yeah. 
but that, whatever. Funny. Yeah. So it was it was funny just watching some people get a little squirmy about that. Not us, but <clears throat> people that are from there. Yes, I, I didn't. Like, realize... Why? What? What do you mean? Or not? Da, 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 da. And I'm just like, well, I, don't, I, don't... I didn't realize until I saw Eric Idle next to you that that dude's really tall. Eric Idle. Eric Idle. The, the, isn't he from Monty Python? No. Yeah. Oh, shoot. What's yes, his name? Yes, he is. What's his name? Mike Idle. Mike Idle. Thank not, you. Not, not <laughs> spelled, every time I not say spelled that the wrong. same way. Right, right. But, you know, yeah, he's, that guy's, you know, pretty damn tall. Well, I'm short, though, too, so. Not that short. I'm short, too, but. Yeah, Depends on where you're standing in the patio yeah, area, that, that because too. it is on a slight incline. Oh. Uh-huh. Because you go to one end of the bar, and bar. You're, you're, like, here. And then you go the further west, and you're about yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so, right. yeah. Not uncommon. Uh, you, yeah, that was fun. So, I did you see my little camera I had? Mm-hmm. Uh, yeah, it worked all right. Uh, it's very sensitive to positioning of sun and such, which is cool. But I got some semi decent shots with it in. Fun. Sixty five bucks. It's right there. Right. It's called that a. Thing. It's called a camp snap. Camp snap. And I thought, well, if I'm going to pull it out while I'm riding and I might fumble it and drop it on the ground, it's, way, it's way better than yeah. my phone. Yeah, that's pull cool. the SD card that out. That reminded me of uh, uh, Scanlon when he had <clears throat> that one camera. I mean, like it was like a Thrill. film Yeah, film that's, that's what they're designing it to be like. Exactly. Film. Film. But he was just like, I, I, br- I brought it along and I'm just going to take some pictures just to see and then process them and see mm-hmm. how it turns out. Mm-hmm. And there's some good ones that he had down there. Oh, posing everybody. Paint the word picture. Right on. Um, yeah, it's it's a cool little device. I like I like the marketing behind it. I like you know the intention. I have a feeling I'll probably buy one one of these days too, and give it to Daniel, so that he can just you know walk around because I think he can withstand a fair amount of abuse. Yeah, there was there's some little tough camera that was pretty inexpensive that I I know Garrett had it, and you just click 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 right. click Ooh. stuffed animal stuffed animal bed yeah, wall I'm click, sure click, click click click. And then it would fly at me. Yeah. Yeah, maybe. So you see how long it lasts. It's like a torture test for that camera. Right. Yeah. Uh, there are some uh, photos in the show notes if you want to see what they look like. Cool. I didn't do a whole lot. I didn't do a whole lot of post-processing, a little cropping and stuff, but they yeah. got a couple different filters you can put in I don't think I took one there. picture. Oh, wait, I did. I was. I took a picture of Porta know. Vita on the side of the camper at Nomad. Yeah. I think it's the only picture I took. I like that camper simply for when I did see it being used as a stage for there that, that reggae Sunday. And I'm like, okay, then everything about it being here makes sense. Yeah. We were <laughs> there right that, before that. For that one, that one deal. And oh. I'm just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. There was a good uh, group shot in front of said camper. You, you know what there was a lot of, though? A lot, of, a lot of top of the hills. A lot of top of the hills? Did you have many hills, top there, hill there, toppers? There were short hills, long hills. <laughs> Are you ready? I'm ready. Is it that well, side? you can. That, yeah, it's that side. It's this side. Uh, JK. JK. Yes, I had four pictures. Rogue. <laughs> Are you ready? Rogue, I'm ready. I'm ready. Rogue Bats. Rogue ready. Brewing Bat Squatch AZ IPA. Yeah, so it's like a vampire Sam Squanch hybrid. 6.7 percentiles. Very tasty. Doesn't taste 6.7. Yeah. Nope. No, it's got a good flavor to it. Yeah. It's it's a little burpy. A little bit. I will demonstrate Hazy shortly. And ju- hazy and <laughs> juicy. It is, uh, where are they out of? They're out of somewhere in Oregon. Oregon Bend? Newport, Newport. Oregon. New Bend? Newportville. They're the makers of Port Dead Bend. Guy Ale True. after Jerry Garcia died, and the initial bottles glowed in the dark. The labels. Wow. Really cool. Oh, I w- uh, is that the... We we had we had that once, mm-hmm. and I almost picked it up again. And the one that they have over at La Casina. I can't remember. The, ah, damn it. I was almost going to buy it, but it was not chilled. Dead guy ale hits It was hits not hard. chilled, and I only had an hour, there so I had to find something that was yeah. in the cooler. No, dead guy ale hits pretty heavy. True that. Last week after the show, something hit pretty heavy, too, didn't it? <sighs> beats. <Well>. Beats, <laughs> beats, 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 beats. That was the first time I'd been to Wiggle Room. It was also, well, yeah, me too. It's not that new. It's pretty new. Yeah, it's since April, I think. Yeah. 
I mean, it was Lee's I luxury lounge it for is, many years. It's gorgeous. I mean, that's a whole lot of vinyl. Holy crap, that's a lot of vinyl. And there's some very interesting building that went on in like bass traps and things that do sound absorbing or reflecting. Yeah. It's like, and close, then, you must close this door for the sound to be, be <laughs> like, I, I, that was amazing to right? watch that. And on the main... What, watching people getting, like, yeah, Von Munn's getting finger wagged <laughs> by Chris Tree. Oh, right, right. On the, <laughs> actual, like, wow. on the actual DJ booth itself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, was like, it was like, no, no, the door has to be closed. I, gotta, I don't know what Keep Chris the vibe going, keep like. the vibe going. Not familiar either, but... but he was behind the bar, the short, oh, balder ish yes, yes. sort of shaved his head really with a beard. We'll get to it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the the actual DJ booth itself, where the turntables are and everything, mm -hmm. goes all the way through the floor down into the basement. To it's like anchored, anchored to the basement floor, so it the, you can bounce and do whatever you want on the floor, and it nice. won't affect the turntables or anything. Somebody spent a bunch of money in engineering in there to make that an interesting. I like venue. it. Venue. I like it. I just I'd say stop like by. Home. Opens at four o'clock every day, as far as I know. And across from the trailer park. True that. And nearby the Blackbird. Yeah, it's you in your, your bay. Options. It's in your Bayview, Milwaukee yeah, area. It's, well, it's like your South Bayview. Yeah, very South Bayview. North Cud, hey. <laughs> the North Cud. <laughs> and that that other one, Tippa Canoe. Oh, and Tigger too. Whatever. How was your ride home, Tony? Yeah. I <laughs> crashed. <laughs> At least it was on a non-trafficked street. I, or a you know, I, so I was, I was, I had a pretty bad light. I'm going to openly admit that my light wasn't very bright, and I probably had too much to drink. And crossing the marsupial bridge, there was construction equipment. They're doing a bunch of work, and I had to cut into the gravel. And as soon as I cut in the gravel, I'm like, I'm going way too fast to do this. And which was only like 14 and I ended up laying it down, but you know, it's and I haven't really like fully inspected it. I might've bent a, a wide loader a little bit. I figure those are like bumper car bumpers. Exactly. So, I'm yeah. like, I, I got, I, the bike was incredibly dusty when I got up cause it was all that gravel from the, <laughs> um, my backpack. It's, I don't have it with me, but it was dusty. I had to wash my hoodie, my WMC hoodie. But I had very minor injuries, and I got up, and I'm like, well, you're, <laughs> you're a dumbass, and I finished riding home. Right uh, on. I had, I, you know, it was, it was not enough that I was even very sore. You know, it was not like, like Dan Kohler's crash on his elbow. I mean, I felt, I immediately thought of him, like, oh, I crashed and grabbed Oh, oh no, those, that was, those are, that yeah. thing's but bad. That, yeah, that's, that's a mountain bike crash. Those guys are dumb. You don't want to <laughs> ride your bike off-road anymore. Not at your advanced age. <laughs> uh, I, did, keep, I didn't. Did, I didn't realize it was going to make ding noises when I just sent it through. Ding, I just sent it. Ding goes the thing. But yeah, that, you Sweet. know the Tuesday and then and then <laughs> Saturday was pretty damn fun. And then Sunday we I ended up at Amorphic for hanging out and trying those wings from that. Oh, I did want to, their I, uh, uh, double B's, double D's, D's, or something like that. Double T. They they were okay. Yeah, I I I'll do it again. I went out to Cedarburg for the wine and Jeez. something harvest festival. It was just rainy and I don't know. They closed Sunday the was, street yeah, down. It was and, rainy. Yeah, so I just like sat, sat outside a couple of the bars and just looked at the my, Packer, uh, <laughs> looked at the Packer game going. Speaking okay, of, okay, speaking of rainy Sunday, uh, my weather station recorded almost two inches of rain. Yeah, I got one point eight. Yeah, yeah me that's too. what it said. I'm glad by actually producing <laughs> right. money, real money right now. Yeah, but I oh. still like watching it to see. You know, it's like, oh wow, that's a lot of rain. So is it like when more stations get added, the the daily uh, reward goes down? I'm gonna guess maybe that's I, why they have only I think, certain many in in each quad yeah because i think yours originally was making almost three per day and now yeah, it's like two point five, five or something yep but it, it is making money and i can't really tell i haven't delved into it enough to see how often it hits my my helium miner in my house there seems to be another another one in the near area that must have a stronger <clears throat> every once in a while every once in a while mine will pick up someone else's but otherwise i watch it fairly regularly because i'm a nerd Right? Just fun. It's fun knowing what's going on in your own backyard. Molly loves it. It is cool. So, yeah. 
See that? Mm-hmm. That's pretty cool. That's a shiny. that's a new shiny WMSE. If if uh, uh, 91.7 sticker. Put it on things that will not it might, decay to obsolescence. Yeah, it'll probably go on my toolbox. With, yeah, with, yeah. with, with all we the 10,000 other me, stickers it's that are going, on there. The we were having, we, remember we were having discussions like, no, well, when you get the good stickers, you got to put it on something that's not going to go away right. anytime. Right. You know. Yeah, that's a good one this year. That that reflectiveness is hot. Also, I don't know if you can see it in the picture, but 2024 supporter stickers on the table now. Yeah. <laughs> I leave mine on my desk. That's WMSC.org, like, folks, if yeah, you want to listen to the I'm greatest like, radio station yeah, I, in the world. Yeah, there's been. And they're, lately, these last couple of weeks have been freaking off the hook killer. Depending on when I, how I get back, what time I get back, can't remember at all. <clears throat> It is on the weekend or the day of Beat Street. <clears throat> okay. So a bunch of the jocks are going to be spinning inside of a cactus club and coming from the airport and taking the bus no matter what. So it's, right, it's right along right the there. thing. When's your When's your trip? Uh, this Sunday. And so you're out next Sunday. Yes, you're out next week. I may probably need to call in for therapy. <laughs> <laughs> Are you going to rent some bikes down there? I don't know. I don't know. You're going, I, gotta, I really got to put my finger on the pulse down there. You're going. You're, you're going Miami way, is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I, you know, I, I feel like I'm just going to need speedos and roller skates. Oh, more than should, <laughs> I, I think you should grab a Super Seven electric cargo or the electric like dirt bike thingy. I'm just going to like absorb a new persona. I've been nice. watching Get the bird. Those. I've been watching watching the bird cage enough. I'm like, you're, don't be afraid of my Guatemalan this. You're, you're gonna you know, actually, my natural Latin heat. Are, are you going to go and get one of those six pack tattoos? No, I'm going to get a cut off shirt like here and with the tassels. Oh, I like it with the belly protruding. The, oh yes, sounds. You could get those uh, red, white, and blue speedos that Casey has. Well, that's why. Yeah. Please don't. That's why I ended up. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh no! I, I see the picture already. I, I see the picture. Oh, don't. But uh, no, that's why I got that Charlie Brown shirt. He's a clown. Good grief! Well, oh, okay. Well, because, I thought it, I thought it was just because it was so bright yellow, and you were doing uh, kind of no. Uh, well, it, uh, yeah, it worked for multifunction sure. on that one, where it was like, okay, well, we should just get some like you know like thin. You know, Hawaiian shirts. We're going to be down in you know just in tourist land instead of paying forty five dollars for something down there. All right. So I was like, yeah, but I just don't want to get a cheesy one. They can get like eight, of, get a, eight of them for ten bucks cool somewhere, one. probably. And it's a Charlie Brown one. Although the you school, gonna wear Miami. The thing, the things don't go all the way around. around uh, Miami is that where you said you're going? South Beach, Art South Deco. Beach. The Art uh, Deco says right on there. So I need at least. You have to have at least one Cuban in a report back. Hell place. yeah. I'm oh, going to be golly. like, that's I mean, going to be on the fucking daily. Yeah, probably, that should man. be. Thank you. I just want to make like sure. A, like a, a rum punch Cuban? There's another. Or a sandwich the Cuban. A sandwich Cuban, We'll go man. with the rum punch uh, Cuban, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's, a, um, there's Very another. Very few things that mix better than a Cuban. There's another sandwich. That's got pickles in it. Oh. Yeah, that's. Oh, I sorry, know, Greg. I know, and I know, and I know. ham. It has. Yeah, of course. Yeah, I tried one it, once just for the. Because I, can I have a can't Cuban say I with no, Can I have a Cuban with no mustard and pickles? Or pickles? <laughs> well, I'm not, uh, I'm not, I'm not right with mustard. <laughs> you can leave is what you can do. Yeah, no. you, yeah. you want to stump the chef, they'll just be like, what are you talking about? All you right, so thing. bike stuff, just because this is sort of ostensibly a show with cycling stuff somewhat. We rode bikes. We rode bikes. Car-free week. Yeah. When's that? September 30th to October 6th. Okay, I can do that. Yeah, yeah, I know. Jay, his, hey, kind of yeah. already does. Yeah, <laughs> been, yeah, I've been car free since uh, early 2020. So <laughs> like, this whole decade has been car free for me, essentially. Um, it is. I, it's a Milwaukee based thing, oh, but really? I think it's a worldwide ask, basically. And it's uh, Ian Kleptar from mm-hmm. Bicycle Benefits. There's a website, carfreeweek.org. You Did can we pass pledge. him? To be car free. I when we were riding up Humboldt, was that who that was? If it was Ian, then it was. I think I'm pretty sure it was Ian. I don't know. You looked at him, but then I went looked at him a couple of times, like, oh dude. I'm pretty sure it was Ian. Was it coming back from somewhere or going to somewhere? We were on our way to Hollander. <laughs> oh, okay. Well then I hadn't had a beer yet. So yeah, right. Hmm. Good question. 
Well, I, I, I don't know. Anyway. You may remember a week or so ago, maybe two, I mentioned the, the Jeff Hall Shawamagon mm-hmm. 40 La Mer electric bike thing. Well, that I, Shawamagon Fat Tire Festival was last weekend, I believe. So he rode it in the race. Uh, was also, you know, a finisher, first place, or top five many times. Strong guy, fast guy. Old guy now, though. Yep. Riding an electric bike. He says, the most fun I've had on a bike in a while, flying down and up the hills like I was 20 again. Thanks to Lemire Cycles for making the fastest pedal assist bike out there. Felt so much like a normal ride. I rode the whole race on the lowest level, got a hell of a workout, and came home with the fastest time in the long course. If you've never ridden one, I highly recommend it. I wish nice. getting older wasn't a thing, but it is. So why not enjoy the ride? Good for him. Right? That's outstanding. Well, you know, somebody that's, you know, competed at a high level and can mm-hmm. say, yeah, makes me feel like I'm 20 again. Heck yeah. That's, yeah. that's, yeah. You can that's, still that's, do that. Yeah. Heck yeah. I, I mean, yeah, I'm not sure I'm feeling like I'm 20 again, but I do not. I, I do no. not mind. Ride, I pretty much ride the Omnium. E Mini Max everywhere now, just because it's not only is it a great bike, but it's also got assist. It just am, it rides so well. Again, we're gonna go back with him. Really <laughs> pissed my bike got stolen, my cargo bike, but my new cargo bike is a billion times better. A billion. I mean, I look, just it, look at orange thingies. Yep, strappy so the, orange thingies. Give me one of those orange thingies. These are um, strap. These are from Pall Mall. You can see them on. Not to be uh, confused with Paul Mall. No, Paul Mall cigarettes. Uh, Pall Mall. No, those are the cheapest ones. He's an Australian. He's a mate down there in Australia. And he makes those doozy. I don't know if Zito ever met him, but <laughs> I was waiting. But um, <clears throat> these are straps that go on the the rack, and they have call these, Zito. Ask him if he's met him. These massive. I'm going to ask this guy if he met Zito and get a little and report. Hopefully, on. yeah, that's a better. Yeah, idea. Um, far engineer. better idea, <laughs> right? So, but, uh, but it gives these nice D rings. There's a little Velcro. Is that a Velcro? Or so? no, 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 that's a that's a. Ooh. Yeah, it just oh, okay, it slides serious. over the rails, and then these things you can put whatever you want to hold stuff. Do on. they flex? Oh, I get it. So I get it. I mean, I. It's not cheap to ship from Australia, but mm-hmm. also the dollar's worth quite a bit against the. Australian dollar? Australian dollar. Is that right? And so I think with shipping and everything, they were like right around 50 for the set. Mm-hmm. And I just thought they were cool enough that I had to get them. And I need them to strap down a bigger version of that their yellow box, which is the orange box that's sitting up. Someday I'll get around to doing a – it's outside. <laughs> it's a Nanook 945, which is a big-ass box for putting camera Nanook shit in. of the North? Yeah, they're made in Canada. Canada. Yeah. I mean, Canada, eh? But uh, yeah, I mean, it. I'll. There will be a link to it. He d- works through Instagram. It was very seamless. I think it took about two weeks from order to actually getting them. So not, bad, not bad from Australia. I mean, twenty four hours to freaking fly there, man. Yeah, for sure. And like I said, I think. I mean, he's not getting rich off of this because I think close to half of the cost of it was shipping. Shipping, right? Which I don't understand shipping from that side of the world to this side because you can ship from China to here for like 12 cents. Right. Want to ship something back? Costs about $1,200. That's because they don't want it. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Tariffs. Tariffs. It's all fucking tariffs. Tariffs. That's crazy. Tariffs or something. All right. So that's Pell Speaking of that, I need to, yeah, my my other Hawaiian shirt uh, was shipped, which means it's sitting in one of those damn... Crates down in Chicago. Uh oh, you know the ones shipped from where? China? Yeah. God oh, I, I, yeah. I looked, Damn it! I, I looked. I looked. At, I looked at the tra- like the uh, the train. Yeah. Like the, <laughs> it was just like it bounced like seven places within China before it even like left country. Wow. I'm gonna open that up like all right. Homer Simpson with right. all the buzz. Yeah. Well, it's like it's like I don't. I, I I'm not such a fanboy that I order every Apple product the day it comes out anymore. But did you? No, not this. Not for a long time. Not since like the iPhone 12 or whatever. Mm-hmm. So you pre-order it, and it shows up on your doorstep the day they say it will. Shipped the day before from, you know, Shenzhen or wherever Funny. the heck. It's like, yeah, it's right there next day. Uh, I think they're trying to sort of. <clears throat> curtail the use of mm, jets for doing that for now but you can it's put not a bad idea really you can put an awful lot of iphones into 747 patience is a virtue 
Uh, by the way, Pell Mell Workshop on Instagram is uh, the place where those straps came from. I th- it looks like he makes other stuff, too. He's got a sewing machine, so he can sew some stuff. But a lot of it is based around the Omnium, which is obviously a great bike. Let us just ch- copy that, paste that. Right. So there was a two. reason behind. I knew there was a reason behind the Sam Bat Squanch. Because that's the thing I'm waiting for that's stuck oh, in the container. Sweet. See how Which it's like, just very, like very subtle. It's like a yeah. Hawaiian shirt but yeah. with subtle Sam Squanches. Sam Squanch has his own island. Mm hmm, mm hmm, mm hmm. Oh, uh, this guy's a dog, too. Almost another inch. He's got a doggy. Doggy. Mm, doggy. Another inch today. Mm-hmm. Er, McGird. We need it. Well, no, we don't, because I might have to cut my grass again. Oh, fuck. I hate cutting grass. Well, good thing you got weeds then. Don't right. have to worry about it too That's much. Why I got weeds. And this, the secondary. It seemed er, to be no grass. Sandwich unicorn. Like a while school I'm down at there. recess. No grass. There you go. Or cl- the Cuban. No, Cuban frita, clover. like your like your lawn, no grass. Micro clover, the That's Cuban frita there. burger. Normally, it's a, a ground beef and pork patty, sometimes mixed with chorizo Ooh. on Cuban bread, topped with julienne or horse string, horse st- blah, blah, blah. shoestring potato fries. You should words, and onions. Oh, I know, I'm trying. <laughs> Other than the onions, sign me up. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, I'm just intrigued by that patty. That sounds great, so, especially if there's a little chorizo in it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. I'm totally. That's my other unicorn. I'm. Mean, it's like it's like yeah. I'll find a Cuban sandwich. I know I can do that. This is my chase item. Yeah, very good. That's legit. Yep. I will it. do it on a bicycle. Thera- bring it all back to therapy you. session. Uh, let's mention the Mark Peterson GoFundMe. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. Mark has been on the show many times. Calls lots. I don't remember how many times, but his, uh, I think he's just getting sort of shafted by the old health care system. Yep. Mm-hmm. I don't know how it works and exactly what is going on, but uh, he does need to pay some bills, and he's just a great friend of the cycling community. So if someone uh, hears, awesome. the, hears this and... Uh, Wants to throw a couple of bucks his way to help with what's going on over there. There is a link in the show notes. Go fund me. Uh, it's long. Let's help our guy Mark out yeah. instead of just Mark Peterson, which maybe would have been a little easier. Yeah, there you go. But there is a link in the show notes. By the way, check out the show notes. There's a lot of good information in there. Love shit. Yeah. Including There's shit. work, but Nintendo, as it, I tell you. Including shit worth doing, which... <clears throat> Well, besides it's car, f- it local shit we're doing. Well, but. not always. I mean, Single Speed USA is in Salida, Colorado. Uh, true, true. Jerry Wright's memorial up in Hayward, and uh, last on the list and a long ways down the road is the Fat Bike Berkey in Cable, Wisconsin, in March of twenty twenty five. March fifth. Not sure if that's five days. Well, it's five days before my mom's birthday, so there you go. She's got oh, that going the, for her. I think she'll go for the full Monty up there. The day after the only day that's a command. March 4th, young man. Yeah, my dad was uh, the Ides of March. Oh, Beware. right on. Right on. Ten, after, 10 days after. <laughs> Excellent. And then in June, rescheduled Queens of the Stone Age in Madison on a Friday. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, nice. June 20th. Get in a hotel. I, haven't, I mean, it, they just announced it, but yes. Do you think... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just when it, when it comes to shit like that, it's like. Uh, Do you think Perry and the boys are gonna tour again? No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't no, know. I'm pretty sure, but I'm still that up cha- I'm chapped. I'm chapped. Mm, yeah. They they fucked up my Love and Rockets little move there. Maybe they'll come. Love and Rockets will come back on their own. They can. Please, they should. Please, and please, please, please. They've got the catalog. They've got the, way better. They have the arsenal. They have yep. the. The way main, better personnel. than... By the way, Arsenal lost two... I think Nil? they'll... Oh, no, they tied 2-2 two, two against Man City Wait. during the Steel is Real Ride. Is that ride. football? Man City and Arsenal 2-2 two, two, during the during the Steel is Real Ride. There were cheers that went up. Did you hear them not? At the, no. Okay. Yeah. I don't follow footy either much, but that was what was on. Football. Only because they're like the only two teams I really know, except for Albion, because Adrian was there and West Brom was playing. Does does everyone like Zito? <laughs> Wait, what? Albin or er, 
What? No, we're talking Adrian. Fucking Adrian. Hey, Adrian. Hey, Adrian. Fuck, fuck an Adrian. Adrian. Why does okay. everyone like to want to say hi to, to, to Zudo? I'm sorry, but every time. Can't do his accent right either. I, I run into mm-hmm. it, Fucking Adrian. Yeah, I, I, it's John. He's John Oliver. Last week with John Oliver. <laughs> Every time I, I watch John Oliver, I'm seeing a Ad- fucking Adrian. I, I, I can kind of see that <laughs> a lot. It drives me insane. All right. Why is everyone saying hi to Zito? Thanks, Adrian, for showing up on the ride. Yes, that was, yeah, awesome. it was fun. Yeah. yeah, good seeing you. All thanks, right, then. thanks to all, and thanks for all the pictures and out to there. All, and the, to all, a good night. Good night. Dun, 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 dun. Good grief.